Hello friends, welcome back. My name is PK. In this video, you will learn how to create PowerPoint slide with ChatGPT quickly on any topic. So here I have opened the ChatGPT window and I will put the prompt here to create the slide. So let me put the prompt here. So here I have put prompt to create the five slides of the PowerPoint on the given topic. I'm putting the prompt here as write the BBA code to create five slides in PowerPoint on below given topic. And we are giving the topic here as use of AI in daily office work. You can change this topic as you want. Then we are putting here in each slide cover three to five bullet points with details. Add first slide as title slide and the last slide as thank you slide. Write the details of each slide in BBA code. Okay. So we have put this prompt and just click on send message. Now it will start creating the VBA code and we will use that VBA code inside the PowerPoint in single click. Our PowerPoint will be generated automatically. Okay. So this is the very quick way and we are not using the copilot also in Microsoft PowerPoint, right? So without using the copilot with the help of chat GPT, we are quickly creating the slides. So here it is writing the BBA code. You can see for each slide. Okay. So this is done. So here we have our code, but you don't need to worry about this code. Even you don't know about the BBA. Simply click on this copy code. The code is copied. Go to your any PowerPoint slide and then go to the developer tab and click on visual basic. If developer tab is not available in your PowerPoint slide, you can simply right click and go to the customized ribbon. And here you can just check this developer checkbox and click on OK. Then the developer tab will appear here. So click on visual basic and go to the insert and insert a module. Paste your code here. All right. So we have that code, but we don't need to worry about this code. Just close this. Now inside the developer code, go to the macros and we can see this macro here. Click on run. Now here you can see our new presentation file is ready and we have all information here, but this is pure text, right? So if we want to create some creative slides, we can use the designer option of Microsoft PowerPoint. So let's go to the designer available on home tab. Just click on the designer. Select the first slide. It will give you the very good option for the first slide. Whatever you want, you can choose. So let's say I'm selecting the first one. Automatically that will appear here. Now go to the second slide and the designer will generate the designs. So whatever you want to take, you can choose. So let's say I'm selecting. So this is here. The third one, just click. And from here, you can choose any option from here again. So let's say I'm taking the this one let's say this time i'm taking the second one come to the fifth slide and here you can choose whatever you want so let's say i'm taking the first one now come to the thank you slide and here you, you can select whatever you want you can go to the downside also and you can click on see more designs also So it will give you some more ideas. So let's say we are selecting any one of them. All right. Now we will enable the slides. So, so this is our first slide. This is the next one. This next, 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 next. So quickly we have created this. You don't need to spend so many hours to create your good presentation. We just have used chat GPT and we have created it. I will show you one more method to quickly create this without using the BBA code also. Okay. Now here this time we will use some different prompt to create the content for the slide. So let's say I'm using here, create the content of five slides of the PowerPoint in each slide cover three to five bullet point with details Add first slide as the title slide and the last slide as thank you. And then we are giving here the topic 
use of AI in daily office work. You can change the topic as per your requirement and the number of slides also. And let's click on send message. Now it will create the content rather than creating the VBA code. So here you can see it is creating the content. All right, so now from here, what we will do, we will copy the slides contents only and we will open a Microsoft Word document. Open the blank Word document and simply paste that content here. Okay, now save this file somewhere in your OneDrive folder. Okay, so in this folder, I am putting the title as use of AI in daily office work, click on save. Just close this. Now come to that folder. We have this file here, right click, go to the OneDrive and view online. So this file is getting opened online. Now from here, if you want to change anything, you can change. For example, I don't want to use this title word here. I don't want to use this subtitle word here. Okay. And let's say I want to put the organization name as new tech navigators and you can put the date whatever you want. But for now, I'm just keeping it as it is. Okay. And press control S save this, go to the file and export. And we can see this one option that is export to PowerPoint presentation preview. Click on this. So here it is showing few designs. You can see you can select any theme of the design or you can click see more themes. So here you can see more designs. Let's say I'm taking this one. Click on export. So this is ready. Now you can click on open presentation. Now this presentation will be opened online mode. Let me put it in slideshow mode. You can see this is our first slide. Now the next one, this is the title slide. So it has added one slide that is the file name as a title slide. Okay. Then here we have more information and it has formatted automatically. And then this is the second slide, third, fourth, fifth and six. You can do the small modifications here and then you can use it. Go to the file and save as and you can click on download a copy. Click on download. So it is downloaded in your download folder. Now you can open it in your desktop application. Just click open file. So this presentation is ready. You can do the necessary changes whatever you want. But this is the quick way to create the PowerPoint presentation. So friends, we have learned about the two method to create the PowerPoint slides with the chat GPT. The first one with the BBA code and the another one using the word file in OneDrive. All right, friends, you can use this trick in your daily life and you can comment how it is helping you in your daily office work while creating the PowerPoint presentation. Friends, I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and please subscribe my channel to get the regular update of my videos. Thank you so much for watching.